Hello, my friends. Welcome back to my channel, Diamonds and Washi. My name's Katie, and if you are new here, hi, welcome. And if you're back, welcome back. Today, I am here with another installment in my Small Shop Haul series. So in this series of videos, I just like to take some time to share with you all about some different small businesses in the community. So um, this is also a video where I share if I've had any friend mail come in and I actually do have one of those packages to share with you all today um, but I always like to mention right up front that if you do own a small shop or know of a small shop that you have not seen me try out yet feel free to let me know I love supporting a huge variety of small businesses in the community and I'm always open to suggestions also, I'm going to link to all of the different small shops that you see in this video down in the description below, as well as their respective social media platforms so that you can follow along with new releases that are coming up and be able to get in touch with the owners if you want. Um, yeah, so uh, be sure to check out these different shops. And at the very least, if you give them a like or a follow or favorite their shop on Etsy, that can be a really fantastic way to support a small shop as well. So I have a bit of a backlog because it has been a little while since I've done one of these videos. Um, believe it or not, this is not all that I have waiting, but I didn't want to have too much for us in this particular video today. I'm going to shift some of these packages just a little bit to the side here, and we're going to start with a package that came in from um, one of my viewers that asked if she could send something over uh, to me over at my P.O. box. So let's go ahead and take a look. This is kind of the little happy mail portion of the video. How are you guys doing today? I hope you're having an absolutely fabulous day so far. I know I am, especially because now I get to get into these packages that have been waiting for me for um, a while at this point. <laughs> uh, I often get the question, how do you wait? Like some people are like, as soon as I get a package in, I have to rip into it immediately. And I just say, I don't, I guess I just, I do it for, I do it for the channel. <laughs> Uh, and it's almost like Christmas because often by the time I get to open some of these packages, I've entirely forgotten what's going to be in them. <laughs> so it's like a surprise. Oh, cute. We'll note this says thank you. Ooh, some goodies. Let's take a look. So Sam, who is Forever Sparkles, uh, wrote a very sweet note here. Oh, thank you, Sam. And yes, my kiddos are on the mat. Now, Sam did send this over. It's been a few weeks at this point, so I do apologize that I'm just now getting the chance to share this, my friend. But thank you so much. <laughs> um, ooh, yum. I will share these with the kiddos. Yum, yum, yum. Oh my gosh, look how cute these stickers are. Look at all the stitches. Okay, I actually really love my little sticker collection. So these are so fun. Kind of always. Oh, I love these. Thank you. And this is her shop, Forever Sparkles. I will be sure to link to all of their social media platforms below and their Etsy shop as well, of course. So let's take a look. These almost, I think these feel like magnets. Let's see what these are. I'm just totally destroying the pretty packaging here. <gasps> cute! Oh my gosh, are these gonna be all these little cute clay figures? It's Cogsworth! Oh my gosh, I love minders, you guys. I'm obsessed with minders. Oh, I love that. A couple of minders here, I love that. So minders, in case you were curious, you can pull the magnet off the back and you can use these to hold back the cover of your diamond painting for the area that you're going to work on. Okay, I'm gonna try. Minders are always tricky because they wanna to stick together. Yay, new minders, I love it. Oh my gosh, Sam, you have completely spoiled me. Oh my 
my gosh. Oh my gosh. I love it so much. It's a low key minder. So I have to go check out her shop. I have not seen her shop before. And so, oh my gosh, I love a new minder shop. <gasps> Look at that little mermaid. I obviously she watches my videos because she knows what I love. <gasps> Okay, all those magnets are gonna stick together. Sam, you have given me the best set of surprises today. Oh my gosh. So you guys, you are never, ever, ever obligated to send me anything whatsoever, but I certainly don't wanna downplay how much it means to me and how much I super appreciate something as sweet and thoughtful as this. Oh my gosh. Oh, look, until the last petal falls. I'm going to have to pull out one of my Beauty and the Beast kits to work on. I am so happy. I love, love, love these. Oh my gosh, look how cute. No coffee, no worky. Amen to that. And that's fun. That's like kind of like a bubble style minder. I love these. Okay, Sam, I'm always curious about how people make minders like if they print things or create things for it or if they're how they're going about making these okay there's even more here oh my gosh i have to get a new minder tin and i'm not even mad <laughs> what's this oh my gosh look at that cute little penguin popsicle oh my gosh that's so cute I cannot wait to go and check out Sam's shop. Again, the name of it is Forever Sparkles. I wanna go see what else she has there in her shop. Oh, cute. Look at that Beauty and the Beast one again. Oh, that's adorable. And a lot of these are styles that like, I have never seen some of these before, so. Oh, yay, Harry Potter too! Oh my goodness. Sam, thank you so much. Okay, this is always what happens to me with minders is they all just eat each other like that. I'm gonna save your note and all that candy as well. Thank you for all of the perfectly me minders. That is so sweet, you guys. I'm not gonna be able to get those to separate from each other right now, so I'm just going to leave it. But those, again, were from the Forever Sparkles Etsy shop. I am really looking forward to going and shopping and seeing what else she has over there. So I do have another package here I'm gonna get into that um, I think this is all This is all things that I bought, but I'm not 100% sure, so I'll include it here at the beginning. Uh, this is from... I'm pretty sure this is the one butterfly resin gems over on Etsy. Now this is a new to me shop and I think that she is pretty new to the community as well. And um, when she contacted me and let me know that she had opened her shop, I was like, Ooh, yeah, a new shop to check out a new, new friend in the community. I think that she also is a part of my Patreon. So, uh, yay. As long as I have the right person, I think this is from Elisa or Alyssa. I'm so sorry if I'm mispronouncing your name. Um, but I'm really so, so curious. I've seen a lot of friends and fellow creators share her trays. And so I feel like this is going to be such a treat to get, get to take a look at them for myself. So let's take a look. Ooh, some cute. Oh, you guys can't really see. So, of course, more stickers to add to my collection. These are really pretty. I always am like, where do you guys find such pretty stickers? Let me double check my invoice here without showing you my address. So, I will, oh, she did include a few extra goodies. So I did order some of these myself and she said she included some extra goodies. And she noted that resin takes 30 days to fully cure. So you wanna handle with care. Um, that means they can have like a little bit of give and so you just want to be, yeah, handling with care, as she said. <gasps> Look at how cute these are. Okay, I believe that the flower was what I had ordered. I think that the star and the bear were bonus goodies. These are made of resin. But even just look at the different effects of their resin. Those are so cute. And they're minders, by the way. So she uh, did leave a note here. Yes, this is from Elisa. Butterfly resin gems on Etsy. Those are so cute, you guys. I love it, love it, love it. Yeah, there's definitely some extra goodies in here. I like how these are packaged. All wrapped up with washi tape. 
So in here we've got, oh my gosh, look how beautiful that is. So this is a minder and it's like a little, you could use this for like little trash drills or even for placing special drills. I love the gold flakes in it as well. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. So um, she does take custom orders, I've noticed. So you can definitely send requests her way as well. Oh, this is a moon. Again, this is a minder, little minder trash tray as well. I just love the colors in it. It's like rose gold and pink and of course the gold flakes. And then there's some trays. I was so intrigued by these. And like I said, I know that she can custom make a lot of things as well. So, ooh, that is so pretty. And this is a stopper that she's included. That is beautiful. Oh my gosh. Now, this is like a really thick and sturdy resin tray as well. Like there's no, no give to it. And it just feels, um, like I said, really thick and sturdy. I don't want to risk bending the resin, but there, there's a tray stopper. That's so pretty. Look at the detail in that. I love the white flowers too. And then, oh my gosh. She she definitely included some extra goodies. So thank you so much. That was so sweet. I will definitely be trying one of these out, uh, these trays out in my next whip and chat. Oh my gosh. So this is the large tray. Uh, this was the small tray by comparison. And where is my coffee? I love that so much. Again, this is really, really thick and sturdy. Like that, I'm so curious to try this out for diamond painting because it has like virtually no give and it's a lot thicker than some some resin trays I've seen. Super, super cute. Like I said, um, not only can, does she take like custom requests, but she has, I think, a wide variety of kind of options available that you can just choose from in her listings. So you can go and take a look at what she already has. And then if you're looking for something else in particular, <gasps> Oh my gosh, this is a total surprise. You guys, oh, what a treat, you guys. <gasps> okay, so this artwork is of, Mar this is Miranda the Tempest by John William Waterhouse. And this is the piece that I worked on last year for Summer with the Masters. And she added some pretty like embellishments here. <gasps> What a treat. So this is kind of what I mean when I say that she can do like really custom orders. Like if you have pictures or anything you want her to include. Uh, so I'm going to have to use this when I do Summer with the Masters, which is coming up here in um, just a couple of weeks. So, oh my gosh, what a special treat. Thank you so, 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 so much. Now, if you did notice, just so you know, I just kind of felt this. This is just an aesthetic thing. Like it's, there's no crack, there's no give here. So I'm not even remotely worried about that. But just in case you noticed, I wanted to mention that I felt that. And look how pretty this is. Thank you so much. What an incredibly sweet and thoughtful gift. So those goodies were all from Butterfly Resin Gems over on Etsy. And like I said, I'll link to her social media platforms and uh, her Etsy shop as well. So yay, thank you so much. Okay, I have a lot of other goodies to get into here. Uh, this next big bag. So this is from a shop I actually have not ordered from in just a little while. This is from DP with Sparklers. And I was kind of thinking like, I want to go see what she has in her shop because I haven't visited her super recently and also um, over in my patreon i do quarterly gifts for the top tier over there and they get they always get some sparklers and washi from my stash and i kind of just wanted to have some more fun special drill options to have to send them oh my gosh <laughs> So i was browsing dp with sparklers because they were running i believe they were running a sale um, and so I picked up a big variety pack. Let me show you really quick. I'll take a look at my invoice really quick. 
So this was the set of crystals and I did get some other regular sparklers. Now DP with sparklers is owned by uh, Tima or Tina. <laughs> uh, Tima is what many people in the community call her. Uh, and she has lots and lots of amazing special drills. She's regularly adding a lot to her selection as well. But she also offers like some sets like all packaged together like this one. So I'll show you that here in just a moment. But first I did order some of just kind of a variety set of some different like sparklers. So I got some sparklers for squares because I actually don't have very many at all in my personal stash. <laughs> sparklers for squares, while they are round in shape, they are small enough that they fit on a square drill grid. So I got a set in Peacock. I love the color shift in these. And then some of the original sparklers, such an amazing neutral. And then I grabbed um, the royal purple. You can kind of see that color shift. There, are, a lot of them are backwards, but you can see that they're small. <laughs> and then some in rainbow, which is another like amazing color shift. So these are just for my own personal stash, because like I said, I don't really have any sparklers for squares, but I have a lot of square drill diamond painting kits lately. Okay. All these crystals have like their DMC numbers. They're all individually bagged. I'm not going to pull all these out because that would just take forever. But this is a giant variety pack of crystals in a, a million different colors. So um, I'm gonna start like pulling from these to send out to like my quarterly Patreon gifts. And it'll just be really fun to have a wide variety of crystals to work with if I decide I do wanna enhance my paintings a little bit. And the nice thing about getting almost a sample set like this is that um, even though you don't necessarily get a bunch of one color, it gives you a lot of options to try. So you can see like is which color works and then go ahead and go back and order like a, a full size bag of whatever color you decide that you'd really like. So yay, I feel like they were really cost effective as well. So I will link to the DP with Sparklers website. You can go and um, take a look, see if anything catches your eye, but yay. <laughs> Happy sparkly mail. Thank you so much, Tima. All right, so this next package that I'm gonna get into here, this is, the, okay, this is much larger than the packages I usually get from Galloway's Gallery, but it is from Galloway's Gallery. <laughs> they make minders. Um, and she has her own website now. She used to be on Etsy and now has her own website. Uh, but she's regularly adding new minders to her shop. And I swear she has like thousands to choose from. I am checking back like almost every day because she is adding so many really cute options regularly. Uh, so I did place an order recently and oops, there goes one. Um, she always packages them with such care. <laughs> and here I am just absolutely destroying the packaging and all of the things. But you could see sneak peek. Rapunzel was one of the minders that I picked out this time. She, again, she has such an amazing variety of minders in her shop. I love it. Okay, I want to not make a huge mess. Okay, there we go. Oh no, I did this the silly way. Okay. <laughs> I just completely made a mess of that. That is okay. <laughs> okay. Hold on just a second. They're going absolutely everywhere at this point. Okay. Okay, you guys, hot mess over here. Okay, so I will try to put these back in here so you guys can see. Um, okay, so here we have this adorable Loki minder. And okay, we have Stitch, <laughs> or not Stitch, I'm sorry. It's um, the dragon from How to Train Your Dragon. And then anyone else a Hamilton fan? <laughs> I'm a huge Little Mermaid fan. I could not resist this one. She added a bunch of um, Encanto themed minders to her shop and I couldn't resist that. Surround yourself with tacos, not negativity. I think I'm not the only one that can relate to that <laughs> sentiment. And then Driver Picks the Music, Shotgun Shuts His Kegel. That's a supernatural reference if you weren't familiar. And then I need my space. 
um, and then Rapunzel. Now I did pull one of these out because it is a gift and so that's gonna stay hidden. This snail over here was a gift with purchase. So go and check out her shop. She has so many amazing minders to choose from, including lots from different fandoms. So if there's something, a particular theme or anything that you're looking for, go and take a look. This is from Galloway's Gallery again and Yay, more minders, <laughs> more minder mail. <laughs> All right, so let me take a quick look. I think, oh no, this one is minders as well. And then the rest is pens. So <laughs> this minder mail is, which which country is this from? Canada? I think this is from Canada. Okay, more minder mail. I think there may be a gift in here as well. So I'll have to take a quick look before I actually show you guys. Yep, yeah, there is a gift in here. <laughs> So this I feel like I wanted to make sure I got to a certain threshold for shipping because a lot of times when you order from international small shops, of course, like I know they're not overcharging me on shipping. Like that's not their goal whatsoever. Um, but it just is what shipping costs. So uh, if there is like a free shipping threshold or it's like if I'm going to be placing an order, I go ahead and order multiple things because um, I want to take advantage. <laughs> it's like I'm going to place the order. Let me try to save a little bit of money while I'm at it. So this was a shop that um, I have not tried before. I want to say that maybe Jamie or Jacqueline, our resident minder queens, may have recommended to me. <laughs> the name of this shop is Stitchy Little Things. Here is the first set of minders that I had gotten. <laughs> like this little turtle. We have a sleeping dragon and Ravenclaw. Now this is actually really encouraging to see because in the listing picture, this particular minder looks like it might be blurry. And so this was a little bit of a kind of like a test order for me to go, are they actually blurry in person or is it just the picture or the lighting? So I'm really happy to see that. Nope, it's perfectly clear. That's so cute. Here's the business card so I can show you guys that. Stitchy little things over on Etsy. Again, they're located in Canada. She says she's on Instagram and Facebook too. So I'll find her social media platforms and be sure to link to those as well. So I have any, any fellow Ravenclaws here. <laughs> I love, love, love these. This is like a metal miner, by the way, but I just thought this turtle was so cute. And then we have, okay, this is one of the ones that I have to hide one of these. Let me cut into this real quick and get this one out of the way. I appreciate that everything is packed with care. And again, like putting the minders on business cards like this certainly makes it less likely that they'll uh, get stuck together. Okay, so here are two more minders. Look at this cute little dragon. And then I hope you get this reference. <laughs> I thought that would be really fun to have for the holidays. <laughs> Holy cow, minder mail. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I do, I store all of my minders in these little tins that kind of help them from all like crashing into each other and stuff. But here are the last two minders. This was actually my main motivation for ordering from this shop. I thought that this set of dragons sleeping together that making a heart with their tail, I just thought it was so cute. And then I can't resist like an adorable seasonal minder like that one. So <laughs> these minders were from Stitchy Little Things over on Etsy. Like I said, I'll link to their Etsy shop and you can go and take a look. All right, you guys, the rest of what I have for you today is pens. I have four pens to share with you all today. I'm going to start with an order from a new to me shop. I'm pretty sure this was a new to me shop called Van Lathe Works. And this was a shop that was recommended to me by a viewer or subscriber. So here's a little thank you note they included. That's so cute. <laughs> I just want to make sure before I look at this is my invoice in here because I don't want to show you if it is. Okay, no. Here is a really sweet thank you card. And here is their business card. And then this is a polishing cloth to keep your pen clean. I've never seen that included with a pen before. I'm so intrigued. Made with love and care and probably some cuss words. <laughs> That's fantastic. 
So again, this is from Van Lathe Works, a new to me shop. You guys, I'm always a sucker for checking out a new pen shop. I, I do have some pen mail from new to me shops that are not gonna be in, unboxed in this video. So if you have made suggestions to me in the past and you don't see it in this video, don't fret. I, I really do try to support every small shop that's suggested to me, but <gasps> look, it's pink. Oh my gosh, you guys. If you know me, you know I love everything pink. I couldn't resist this when I saw it. Like it's shades of super sparkly pink. Now it doesn't look like tips were included with this. I may have foregone tips. I have extras. Um, I'll have to double check and see if that's an option, if you can ask for tips to be included. But um, you know, it's got double ended, so you can use a multi-placer and a single placer. This is so sparkly and so pretty. It's extremely lightweight and really ergonomic and comfortable to hold. So look at that sparkle. Oh my gosh. So yeah, I like the, the way that it's been turned. Again, it's really comfortable to hold and very, very, very lightweight. They had a variety of different turning styles and whatnot. So go and take a look and see if anything catches your eye. They had a variety of blanks and, and um, turnings as well. So again, this is from Van Lathe Works on Etsy. I will link to their shop. So thank you so much. And thank you to the viewer who had suggested them to me. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, uh, this next box, this next package, this is from Butterfly Effect Wears. This is from a, one of their releases a couple weeks back. I'm trying to remember what the exact colorway even was at this point, because again, this has been sitting for a little while. <laughs> um, but again, it's like it's like Christmas morning. It's like oh, it's a surprise. What did I order? But it's from it's from Butterfly Effect Wears, so I know it's going to be beautiful. They do different colorways about weekly it seems like and they do also open up custom orders from time to time so um definitely take a look and if there's a particular colorway that you're wanting for yourself you can put in a request for it so all their pretty packaging they always seem to include an airhead <laughs> and a butterfly sticker and then here's their beautiful i love their business cards they're like iridescent like pearl essen effect john and abby lewis are the owners they are so incredibly sweet so what colorway was this anyway oh that's right this was the pastel rainbow <gasps> gosh look how pretty it is now i am a sucker for pastels and a pastel rainbow yes please especially with pride month coming up i don't even remember what tips i requested because i was just trying to check out as quickly as possible i'm sure that you can choose a multi-placer tip but apparently i just picked angled tip again i was just trying to check out quickly so i didn't mess out because you guys their pens sell out so fast, so, 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 so fast. And for good reason, because they're absolutely beautiful. They have a variety of different turning styles and um, really they do like, I think mostly all custom pours and no two pours seem to turn out exactly the same, even if it's the same colorway. So jump on it when you see a pen stock that you love. <laughs> Thank you so much, Butterfly Effect Wars. I love it. It's gonna be perfect for Pride Month coming up. Yes, I'm here for it. All right, you guys, I have two more pens here to show you. Let me kind of shift some stuff so we have a little bit of space. I know all this minder mail that's just kind of piled on top of each other. I'm so sorry, my friends. Um, okay, so this one is from Jim's Handmade Pen Shop on Etsy. Jim's Handmade Pen Shop is the very first place that I ever ordered a diamond painting pen from. He has a huge variety of blanks available and you can choose if you want it turned i think in is it two three and four bump or just three and four bump it's it's um his shop i think one of the, the things that has the most going for it is the fact that he has a huge 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 selection of blanks and he's regularly adding more so um Again, he, I have a lot from his shop <laughs> because he was the very first shop that I ever ordered from. But he stocked these gorgeous bloom blanks <sighs> recently. <laughs> um, and I couldn't resist this one in particular. So, oh my gosh. <gasps> that is so pretty. And it's so interesting that like the wood on this hybrid is 
like just flat. <laughs> but look at the level of detail in these beautiful pink florals and mesh. I love it. So this is in the four bump style. And um, as far as like sort of thickness goes, they tend to be like medium thickness and kind of the range of pens out there. But he still has a lot of really beautiful bloom blanks with kind of like florals in them to choose from. So definitely go and take a look at what he has to offer. This is absolutely gorgeous. And it did come with a multi-placer, but very comfortable. <laughs> that was my pen from Jim's Handmade Pen Shop over on Etsy. And then finally, um, this last package, this is from Black Wolf Woodworks. Black Wolf Woodworks is another one of my favorite uh, diamond painting pen shops. I love his blanks. He does a lot of really beautiful pours. I recommend following him on Facebook because he'll share uh, his ideas there and you can even like share your input on what colors he should do next. So James Clevenger is the owner, Black Wolf Woodworks. Like I said, definitely follow on Facebook. He also creates some other really beautiful handcrafted uh, goods, not just pens, but I'm, I'm really a fan of his pens. So <gasps> look at how pretty this is. Oh my gosh. So I really loved the colors in this one, the greens and yellows, and it's so shiny. Oh, there's a little bit of dust here on the end. That's okay. Um, and I think that he just turns the pens in whatever way sort of suits the blank. Um, I really like this a lot. Uh, I, I don't know if you can request a specific shape, but I just always, I'm like, I just trust the process. Your pens are always ergonomic to hold. I love that this is a hybrid. It is so beautiful. So again, this is from Black Wolf Woodworks. He did include the tips separate, so I'll pop those in myself. But for now, I'm just going to look at how pretty and shiny that is. So, oh my gosh, you guys, this was a really, really fun small shop haul to get to do with you all today. I am feeling so very, very loved and spoiled by the amazing small shop owners in our community. I'll mention again that if you own a small shop or if you know of a small shop that you would like for me to to try out. Feel free to send that to me. You can either leave it in the comments of the video. You can send it to me over on Instagram. You can send me an email and I will do... <laughs> I was going to try to set these minders out just kind of by themselves. It's not really working. Um, you can send it to me by email, anything at all. I would be more than happy to go and you know what we're just gonna leave that there uh to go and check out different small shops whether it's one you own or if you know of one so uh thank you so much to all the small shop owners for all the hard work and heart that you pour into creating such beautiful handcrafted products that we all get to use and make our diamond painting and crafting experiences just that much more magical <laughs> you guys i'm going to link to all of these shops below as well as their associated social media platforms go and show them some love and um like I said, favorite their shop, follow along with their social media because that's a wonderful way to support small shop owners as well. All right, my friends, let me know if you have any questions whatsoever. I hope you're having an absolutely wonderful day. If you're not already subscribed and want to see a lot more diamond painting content from me, including future small shop hauls, feel free to subscribe. I would love to have you. All right, friends, have a wonderful rest of your day. I'll chat with you in the next one. Bye. Mm -hmm.